Well, we're banding probably the last birds of the season today. Hopefully Donna will find that the baby is in the nest and is, and is not too old to band. So this is exciting. We've had some heavy rains last night, but it is clear today, a perfect day for this attempt. If there are birds in the nest, Donna will be banding them right here on the back of her truck. So let's walk over to where the nest is located. So I'm glad I'm wearing waterproof boots this morning. Okay, I've got it. Step away, please. And once I've got it, then y'all stand back in case I lose my grip. Perfect. Tell me if a bird comes so I don't hit <laughs> them the ladder. Oops. Get my bag ready. Donna's continuing to try to, to noose the baby. And if we're lucky, she'll pull one out. Now, noosing the, the baby like this does not harm the baby. So far, she's not been successful. Oh, we had baby, but it's gone. I just had it barely by the wing. One more try and then that's it. I don't want to traumatize it. and It's kind of big, so you don't want to hurt it coming through the hole, even though it's just one. If I can get a better hook on it. I saw a wing though. Okay guys, sorry to disappoint, but baby bird comes first. Yeah, so he's a little too old. He's seeing my news. He knows what I'm up to and he's getting a little big. So we're gonna have to abort. Sorry guys. From photographs and spotting scopes from other birders and from our own birder here, Debbie, I have located three out of four of our translocated Louisiana birds. And let's see here. 
not. I think the uh, female that we put in cluster 11, the one on the far south side, was photographed in cluster 12 north, which is still on the south side, but a different cluster, just on the, on the uh, north side of the stand that we put them in. The right leg was visible and I, could, I couldn't see all the, the colors clearly, but from what, just by looking at it and guessing at what I thought the colors looked like and then looking on here, I'm pretty sure it's that female that we put down there. So the conclusion is the translocation project is successful. Yes, cause I've been told by someone who does it more often that, hey, if you find 50% of the birds are doing good, we found 75%. <laughs> of course, that's how Well, then let's, let's give an applause. Yay. Let's give a hand. Yay. Yay. Yay for those Cajun birds. <laughs> so hopefully we can find the other one. Hopefully they'll find either a, a place of breeding here amongst the groups that we have now, or they will pair back up together and find their own group, start a new group. That would be awesome because we would have more groups out here and more uh, fresh blood coming in. So, uh...